Okay, ladies and gents, um, just following up uh, on uh, the African Charter on the Rights of the Welfare of the Child. This is Gary, Fathers for Justice South Africa. Um, okay, and um, it's Article 19, Parental Care and Protection. Uh, Article 19.1. Every child shall be entitled to the enjoyment of, of parental care protection and shall, whenever possible, have the right to reside with his or her parents. No child shall be separated from his parents against his will, except when a judicial authority determines in accordance with the appropriate law that such separation is in the best interest of the child. Okay. The way I read it, it is up to the ju justice system to prove that it is in the best interest to keep the child away from one or both of its parents. Okay. Uh, Article 19.2. Every child who is separated from one or both parents shall have the right to maintain personal relations and direct contact with both parents on a regular basis. Article 19.3. When separation results from the action of a state party, the state party shall provide the child or, if appropriate, another member of the family with essential information concerning the whereabouts of the absent member or members of the family. State parties shall also ensure that the submission of such a request shall not entail any adverse consequences for the person or persons in whose respect it is made. So why are we continuously being subjected to unnecessary delay in the legal system? And why are we continuously being prejudiced financially to prove our right of contact with our children? Okay. Where a child is apprehended by a state party, his parents or guardians shall as soon as possible be notified of such apprehension by that state party. Okay. So once again, we just prove over and over and over and over and over and over again how the, 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 uh, the, the, the government of South Africa flies in the face of treaties and, 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 and charters that we are signatories to and how it actively aids and abets in the destruction of the relationship between the child and one or both of its parents. So, you know, state-sanctioned legalized child abuse. I go on and on and on about this all the time, guys. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. Please join the class action suit. Please pay the 90 rand a month. The 90 rand a month allows me to continue this work, assisting you to educate you about your rights and your child's rights and the rights of the child and the child's right to have a, a family unit and the child's right of association with you as a family member and so on and so forth. So please support me to support you, to support us, to support our children, to support our society. Okay. Uh, please like, share and subscribe. Uh, you, alternatively, you can go to info at f4j.co.za um, or you can go to www.f4j.co.za. Thanks very much. Bye.